Hello and welcome back to the Football Zone and welcome to the Championship 2019-20 season review. The season is now over in the Championship um, and Leeds, West Brom and Fulham have been promoted to the Premier League. Leeds deservedly romped to the title, winning 28 of their 46 games to finish 10 points ahead of second place West Brom. Fulham came up in the playoffs beating Brentford in a nervy final. Read as we take a closer look at some of the key talking points from the 2019-20 and have a brief look at who could be challenging at the top end of the table next season. Leeds were worthy winners of the championship ending their agonising 16 year wait to return to the top flight in style. Marcello Bielsa's side were relentless on the run in and deservedly secured top spot with two games to spare. Bielsa has totally transformed Leeds' fortunes, implementing an innovative style of football that the rest of the division has found difficult to live with. If Leeds invest wisely in their squad this summer, it would be no surprise to see them make their mark in their return to the top flight of English football. West Brom survived a late season wobble to finish the campaign as runners-up and join Leeds in securing promotion to the Premier League. The Baggies picked up just three points from their final four matches. However, Brentford and Fulham also stumbled over the line and couldn't capitalise. The club's decision to appoint Slavon Bilic as manager paid dividends and he can ultimately f reflect on a job well done at the Hawthorns. His team's ability to score, uh, recover after conceding the first goal was testament to the motivational powers and played a key part in them securing promotion. A remarkable combination of results on the final day allowed Swansea to snatch the final playoff spot from Nottingham Forest. The Swans triumphed at 4-1 against Reading to move into 6th position on goal scored above Forest, who had lost by the same score at home to Stoke. The Welsh club will head into the post-season uh, shootout, which they eventually lost to Brentford in the second leg, despite having the lead in the first leg, in a buoyant mood. And I thought they would have fancied their chance of beating Brentford, given the form that they'd been on. However, it just wasn't to be, and it eventually had a Brentford v Fulham final, which Fulham just edged to get into the Premier League. Hull, Charlton and Wigan have all been relegated to League One, although Wigan's demotion was subject to an appeal, though the appeal has now been heard and they will definitely be playing League One football next year. All three clubs have been impacted by off-the-field issues with the team, with Wigan certainly the most con controversial. The Latics suffered a 12-point deduction for going into administration, but the circumstances surrounding the issue are shrouded in, in controversy. Administra Administrator Gerald Krasner has confirmed that the club will fight against what it perceives to be injustice in a case that doesn't reflect particularly well on the EFL although not much does. Norwich City will be amongst the favourites to make an immediate return to the Premier League next season, but it would be dangerous to assume they will mount a serious challenge. Relegated teams often struggle to get a grip with life back in the second tier, and the Canaries could easily continue that trend. The three teams who lose out in the playoffs should all be in the mix again, providing they don't suffer a hangover or the disappointment of missing, around, missing out. Forrest, Blackburn and Mill are also capable of forcing their way into the reckoning, having finished on the fringes of the playoff battle this season. But anyway guys, that's it for this video. Thanks very much for watching. Remember to like, share, subscribe. Let me know what you thought about this video and the championship season in the comments down below. Remember to follow me on Twitter, link in the description for daily football news. And subscribe to my other channels on screen right now. That would be greatly appreciated. Thanks very much for watching. Peace.